Okay, so we are just east of the Poseidon Reservoir, and we're going to go for a bit of a swim, because there is an item right on top of this pipe. Well, if you want to call it an item, it's more a person. Hello there. And, uh, yeah, Danny Boy apples and a plastic pumpkin. Oh, whoa, I'm in the water. Ah, need to get back up. There we go. Okay, so... Uh, theories, theories, theories. I would say... See, if this was a little bit under the water, I would have supposed they got stuck here and, like, when the water level was a lot higher, they accidentally got, like, sucked in and they were stuck here, and that's why they're still here. I'm starting to think maybe that's not the case. Perhaps they were on one of the boats, because if we drain the water away, we can actually see that there is a boat directly, not directly. There's a boat somewhere. Where's the boat? There it is. Oh, there's a boat there. Perhaps they were on the boat going over to Trick or Treat, maybe across the lake, or who, who knows? She was maybe out with the sweetheart um, or the boyfriend or something. And, yeah, that, I mean, it's a potential theory as to how they ended up here. I I'm wondering, if the water level was higher, though, it probably would have flooded quite a lot of the surrounding area. So, maybe, maybe that's not the case. You're talking about at least three or four feet of water. A meter, if that helps anyone else. And, well, well, this is a tough one. It's very hard to pin it down as to what exactly happened here. I mean, I suppose it was left as a bit of an Easter egg, if anything. I'm going to toggle no clip and see if we can see anything on the bigger pipe. No, anything in the pipes. A bit of water and rubbish, but obviously this pipe's been completely blocked off uh, because of uh, the debris. Uh, same goes for this one. Did any items drop in? Nope. Drink the water. Ugh. It's a bit, uh, a bit bogging for you. Yeah, again, if you want to see where it is, east of the Poseidon Reservoir, just in the middle of Lake Cockatoo. And as a two for one, I'm going to take away the water and show some of you that maybe didn't see the steamer trunk in the previous episode. It is located directly there. Best way to triangulate yourself, go to the bathtub, uh, swim about halfway, and then swim straight down. And uh, you don't need to unlock it. It's free to go. You can get some decent items in that trunk. Right. Now that we've covered that, there's a few places along the freeway here, and then uh, we're going to go down towards the likes of Natick and uh, beyond. Catch us in the next one. Thank you.